What's up, party people? So today's video is gonna be about this wig that is getting in my last nerve. But anyway, welcome back to my channel. If you know who I am, hey. If you do not know who I am, please hit the subscribe button so next time we will know each other. Okay, so let's get down to this video. This wig, I got one wig type. Okay, so it's supposed to be a blow-out, um, kinky texture, not, um, yakky texture. And I really do like those type of wigs because I feel like they work better for me. And it's easier to manipulate to my head type. So I was kind of happy for this. I got it in 1B. I saw a video on it and I was like, okay, good. That's the wig for me. I The idea was to do a... a like a braid out on it okay so i'm thinking my curl about to be popping we're about to be on this and then this wig came when it first came out it's supposed to be a natural pre pluck oh yeah i said it right here natural pre um pre pluck um okay so this is the part all right cool but when it first came this as you can see this is not its natural state when it first came it was like a blowout kind of thing but the problem with that one it broke it first. My intention was to do a twist out, not a twist out, a braid out. I tried to braid out, left it alone for like two days, and when I was getting ready to film, this wig did not curl at all. It did not hold the curl. So that was strike one. So I was like, all right, cool. Let me see if I can curl it. No. It, the heating is not heat responsive so at this point I'm like this the wig is so big because it was so puffy and whatnot which if it had some like curls to it it would have been cute but it being this big and it was like in its natural state it was not what I was going for so I was just like right, I'm not gonna waste my money let me try to flatter in it and this is it right here in this flattering state um, I'm not too fond of it in this flat iron stage because number one, um, it tangle a lot, it get tangled a lot. Number two, it shed a lot. And number three, it just get ugly in 0.5 seconds. So I guess he was supposed to stay in this natural state, but it's just not working out. And one thing I did like about the wig when I did saw it because my head is so small, it had the elastic band itself. And I was like really happy. It's like, you know, about to my way back to be snatched but that damn elastic was so tight that to the point i put this wig on within like five minutes i feel like the blood stream from my brain was just like thinning and i just felt like i was about to pass out that's how tight it is the whole point is for me to keep my edges then i cannot i can feel my edges like leaving me that's how tight this damn thing is so at this point i try to do another solution and ugh, look at this shit I so that's how annoying I was. I went ahead and just tied the band, like I cut it off because I was not able to even wear the wig without getting a headache. So I cut it off and then it become a little comfortable. A little comfortable, but it didn't help nothing because it get uglier when you see. I just brushed this shit before I came here. Try to make it look nice and decent and it'll look like something I just picked out of the trash can. And overall, like, I would not recommend this wig. It was a waste of money. I don't know what to do with it because this wig just upset my soul, okay? But um, the only good thing about it was, like, the pre-pluck lace. That's it. If you guys can see. That's all that was the only good thing about it. After that, this wig is trash. So, that was all for this video. I hope you guys enjoy and save your money. I wish I had got a decent review when I looked the wig up. Save your money and do not purchase this wig. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Deuces. Oh, yeah. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Y'all already know. Deuces.